Hey guys, so I want to talk about first things I read, uh, get this shit back on track. Uh, so, first things I read, uh, Big Man Plans. One of the freaking best books that I've read in, I don't know man, maybe since I started reading comics again, man. This book was so good. Uh, Eric Powell, knocking it out of the freaking park. I don't know anything that he's done before. But I need to look that up and figure it out because this book is amazing. And I hope that this continues and that I get more big man plans because I'm curious as to what he could do out, you know, outside of this book. Um, it just, four issue series, man, do yourself a favor. Big man plans comes out in trade, go pick that stuff up, man, because, God, it is freaking good, man, awesome, second, I read Starve, um, uh, man, Starve 2 was better than Starve 1, I like Starve 1, but 2 was better, uh, basically, the elimination round, they have to go out and find a blue fin tuna, which is, uh, basically an extinct fish, and, um, so, they have to go out and rob, cheat, and steal to get their fish, and, uh, there's, like, a little, like, underlying, um, you know, what's going on with, uh, with this series, and the wealth, and everything that was just freaking awesome, man. Love that freaking book. Best book I've read in so freaking long. God, I can't believe that I'm about to talk awesomeness about freaking Star Trek Green Lantern. This book was so freaking good. So good. Uh, I did not want to like it. I thought it was a train wreck. I thought it was a car crash that I couldn't look away from. No, it wasn't. It was just a good book. Mike Johnson, uh, which is a co-creator on 8 with uh, Rob Hill Albuquerque did this book and it is freaking amazing um, amazing <laughs> I just can't say enough about how good this freaking book is it was so freaking good from a Green Lantern standpoint and a Star Trek I know what's going on it was just like everything was just perfect and uh Oh my gosh, man. Uh, you know, they find they find Gannett dead on this planet with all the rings. And um, <laughs> they bring the rings onto the, onto the Enterprise. And then all freaking chaos ensues as they have a battle with the Romulans and the Klingons. And the rings find new people to... Oh, man, I God, I can't wait to see what this is going to do. Awesome freaking, awesome freaking book. Archie, number one. Uh, I've been an Archie fan for a long time. I don't talk a lot about Archie, but I've really enjoyed Archie. My grandmother, whenever I was growing up, used to buy me Archie Digest. Um, really enjoyed this. Uh, Fiona Staples' art in this was freaking awesome. Um, and I really honestly can't wait for the Jughead comic. I don't know who the colorist on this book was. The coloring on this book was freaking amazing. Uh, Andre Shabaskowski. I, I just butchered that, but freaking amazing. I read Tomorrow's, uh, this book confused the shit out of me, to be honest. I did not understand where this was going or what it was doing. Um, something that I've learned with Kurt Pyre is that I have to wait to see where his series is going. And I'm willing to wait to see where this series is going. Um, because the first issue was really good. Um, the art on it was freaking amazing, the color on it, the coloring on it was freaking top notch, uh, panel layouts, everything about this book, really enjoyed Tomorrow's from Dark Horse, 
and then Strange Fruit. Uh, did not like this book at all. Uh, I can say that the art on this book, freaking phenomenal. Uh, the way that he painted these panels is freaking amazing. Uh, Mark Wade tried to write a story, but I just don't get it. And, uh, yeah. Anyway, that's about all I got to say about that. Uh, I'm get off here, get around reading some more comics. Uh, I also, at the shop, read Red Hood, number two. Number two was not as good, I thought, as number one, but still a decent series. Um, I read uh, Ghost Racers. Number two, man, that series is freaking good. Um, I didn't realize that it was Tamara Bullivan who I rant on constantly for how amazing her coloring is. I didn't realize that she was doing the coloring on that, but now that I do... I'm happy that I'm picking that up, and, uh, yeah, anyway, uh, I'm gonna get off here and, uh, read some comics. By the way, Arkansas, watch my freaking videos, man.